Vehicles that can travel on the highway or the river. And believe it or not, they are made right here at home. Low Country reporter Jamie Daly visited the plant in Jasper County and now joins us live with all the details. So, Jamie, these vehicles are pretty cool. They are very cool. The owners of Cool Amphibious Manufacturers International, or CAMI, have created all kinds of amphibious vehicles, from luxury RVs to high-end sports cars. It may look like something out of the movies, but the Hydra Spider, along with other unique amphibious vehicles, are built and manufactured right at this plant along Interstate 95 in Ridgeland, South Carolina. This is the start of the spider body. John and Julie Gilgem built Cool Amphibious Manufacturers International from the ground up. And it all started with an idea to improve their amphibious tour business on Hilton Head Island. John has a master's captain's license, and I was the first mate. We had to run with an old Lark, which was a vehicle. It was wide. It was cantankerous. It was a difficult piece of equipment. For every single day we went out on a tour, we'd have to wrench that night and do work on it. With a background in manufacturing, John decided to build his own amphibious vehicle. I want to do engineer something that was safer, unsinkable, and use mass-produced parts and be able to service my vehicle that day. And the first Hydra Terra was born. While it was meant to replace their old vehicle, another tour company caught wind of it, and they sold it and built another. We were going to get the second, and then we were going to get the third, and then we were going to get the sixth. And after we were going to get the 13th, we realized we were not going to get a Hydra Terra for Cool Stuff Tours. Instead, they went into the manufacturing business. The New York plant builds the hulls and does the aluminum and uh, forming of the hulls. They've got the jig up there, and then they bring it down here, and the guys down here put all the running components, make it run and drive systems. mechanical systems. Then they created this amphibious RV called the TerraWind with all the comforts of home, and it wasn't long until the Hydra Spider sports car came about. It's fun. That's fast. It, it hops up on plane, and it's fast on the water, and it's a lot of fun. Cars started out uh, over $200,000 for the very first one, and right now we're building one for a, a gentleman that's going to Monaco uh, to go on his yacht in Monaco, and it's over $300,000. And each one is built with their special patent. The only U.S. Coast Guard certified vessel that is unsinkable. We have flotation foam in our vehicle. You can pull all of the drain plugs out of the bottom of the, uh, the boat and it remains upright afloat. Now they're going green with this energy efficient biotrike. This is biodiesel powered. You can run diesel or uh, biodiesel. It is a uh, very high mileage. We get 80 to 90 miles to the gallon just running around locally. And although it only runs on the road, this first prototype draws quite a bit of attention. Now, the company began in 1999, and they now have vehicles in 13 different countries. Now, right now, they've got a lot of things going on, including they're hoping to go into full production of that biotrike we just showed you, and they're hoping to come up with a four-seater that would be handicap accessible. So a lot of things going on. But, Jody, you know, the one thing that really impressed me whenever I went there, obviously they're very successful, but one thing that I thought was really impressive is that when you walk into the plant, it's just like a family atmosphere. Everyone kind of takes care of each other, and it was really nice to see. It's, Jody? An, it's an amazing company, and nice to know that we have it right here at home. And I like the unsinkable part. I do too. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Jamie.